Hi, I'm Bree Strohmeyer for Pet360 at the Los Angeles Strut Your Mud event. Hi. Today we're talking to legendary Broadway and television actress Cochita Tomei. For a while, you were actually actually rescuing a lot of animals for oh, a yes, long for time. Many years, yeah, for about 20 years, I rescued about 200 cats and dogs that were tied to. Um, parking meters in New York in the winter and I would just untie them when I'd seen them in the morning they'd still be tied I think when they're still tied at night I just untie them and bring them to my vet or into my studio apartment <laughs> in New York which is really small and um, two you had a full house yes a full house and 200 cats in New York and um, I owned personally six cats all rescued and a dog named Toby it was the love of our life and we um, lost him three years ago I now have one cat left and he's 20 years old, his name is Spencer. Had a cat, Joey, an orange tabby, that I rescued with my father, who was a policeman in Wisconsin. He outlived my dad. You know, <laughs> pets living with me, it's like Club Med. All the people I know, they seem to go to the other side before my animals get there. So, because they're, you know, you have to take such great care and respect of those that depend upon you. Yes, now, does this one cat have any special tricks or things that this cat does that no other cat might do? Uh, my, my little Spencer, always in the morning, he just kind of stretches and, you know, just does that stretch and roll, and that's his, his morning um, salute for us. But he's deaf as a post. He has a little thyroid problem, but he walks, he, he scales a counter. I mean, he go from the kitchen floor to a counter, and at 19, he'll be 20 in October. I haven't seen any cat. I mean, some 13, 14-year-olds. But I had a 19-year-old, um, a 20-year-old, an 18-year-old. No children. These are all four-legged. <laughs> and um, my dog, Toby, was an Italian Valpine. He went to 15. And he would have gone longer had he not had bone cancer. And they're all rescued. All, every single one is a rescue animal. So what's it like to be involved with an event like this today, being a longtime animal lover? Well, I've known Silva and Francis Batista, who started Best Friends in 1997. It's about reaching out and helping those that can help themselves and depend on us. And I always think that animals have no voice and no choice, as do children, abused children, abused animals, or just forgotten or neglected children or animals. They have no voice and no choice. And we are their stewards. Yeah. We are their angels, their earth angels. And they are ours because they give us so much joy. There's so much payback when you own an animal, um, you know, because they have that unconditional love. So. It's, it's, it's time that we take all responsibility, you know, not only for um, each other, but, you know, the planet. Thank you so much for oh, talking to Pet welcome. 360, and we're melting. It's so hot out here, we but we're are. still having lots of fun. God bless you all. Adopt a pet and be kind to them. God bless.